Hi, I'm Mr. Gonzalez, and today we're going to draw hearts like these on the wall behind me, and like these using line. All right, let's get started. Let's take a closer look at these hearts, and you'll see that they are made with straight lines on either side and curved lines in the middle of the heart. These curved lines are going up, kind of like a rainbow. And some of the colors are touching, and some of the colors are separated with some space in between. So think about what you want to do, find your favorite colors, and plan it out in your head. Think about the heart shape that you want to draw, and you can have it be real simple with just lines like this. Or you can choose to put designs like stars and zigzags and other things in the curves that you make, like this. This is just a reminder that you will need to pause the video every now and then to give yourselves some time to draw. So don't forget to do that. All right, so let's draw a heart. A heart has two curves on the top and a point at the bottom. So I'll start right here in the middle. There's one curve at the top. That's going to be a point. And here's the other curve. Lovely, I have a heart. Now that you have your heart that you drew, you're ready to put color and stripes on it. Let's look at, at a few of these examples. This heart, you'll, you'll notice like the background above the heart and below the heart, these are straight lines, you know, they're very straight. And even on the sides, they're straight lines. But when they go over the heart, they are curved. You see the curved lines? Look at this example of a rainbow heart. Straight lines, and once they meet the edge of that heart, they curve and then keep going straight. Up at the top, they're straight all the way across, and at the bottom, they're straight all the way across. Here's one without any color. It's just used, I used a black marker to draw these lines. So you can see it's straight up at the top, just straight line all the way across, and it's straight until it hits the edge of the heart and goes up and down, and then straight and then up and down. So let's do this together, okay? Go ahead and pause the video to give yourself some time to draw your own heart. All right, all you'll need is a piece of paper, a pencil, and some markers. So let's get started. First thing is to draw a heart. Now I'm gonna draw a heart kind of in the middle of this paper. Nice. Once you have your heart drawn, you're going to use markers. And you can use any colors you want. I think I'm going to use, I don't know, uh, pink <laughs> and black for this one. I don't know, what do you think? Maybe, maybe I'll use yellow also. And what I'm going to do is draw lines going across and make it look like it's a three-dimensional heart by using curved lines, okay? Let me show you how to do that. I'll start off with yellow. All right, so the yellow, I'm going to, right in the middle of the heart, draw a big arch, a curved line, okay? And then you could use yellow again or whatever color you want. And on these lobes, the top part of the heart, in between here, I'm going to draw one arch and another arch. Just two curved lines. And then I'm going to do the same thing right here and there. Below, it's just a bunch of curved lines.
I'm not using any particular order. I'm just mixing up the colors. So you can see the heart looks like it has curved stripes. Now would be a good time to pause so that you can give yourself some time to draw and get to this point. Now what you're going to do, wherever there's an end of the line right here, you're going to make it straight. So if the black line goes this way, I'm gonna use a black marker the black marker and there's more than one way to draw this Do your best with the top curves of the heart so that the top of your heart looks nice. Now, after I have my heart full of stripes, I can fill in these stripes if I want. Using my markers to color. And of course, you don't have to just use markers. You can use crayons, pencils, even colored pencils, whatever you have. Just have some fun with it. Let's see. I think I wanted to add a little bit of yellow here. And then I'll add the black. I hope that you're seeing how these curved lines help show the form of the heart. They help create the illusion that is three-dimensional. Now look at me draw really fast. No, I'm just kidding. I sped up the video to save some time. And you can see how I am drawing new lines and making some of the existing lines thicker. So go ahead and do this with your design. Below the heart, go ahead and add straight lines, and above the heart, you're going to add straight lines. Make sure that you have broken lines where the lobes of the top of the heart overlap. And there's my heart. Don't forget to put the caps of the markers back on. You don't want the markers to dry out. I thought I'd share with you another example about how to draw a heart. And this one, I'm gonna show you how to draw it with patterns in the stripes. So I hope you like it. All right, one way you can do this so that you're organized is right in the middle of your heart, draw a big curve, okay? And now you can practice with your finger before you draw. Okay, that's going to be my curve. Nice. And then go ahead and draw a line and another line. 
you can you can see how that line looks like the heart is puffing up from the paper okay we're going to do that below this and you can use the same color nice good job we're going to do some more lines all the way down okay now remember that the lines are curved when they hit the heart but below the heart yeah they're straight there's a straight line below the heart and above the heart it gets a little tricky so let's go ahead and draw our straight lines above the heart. Now, this is probably the most tricky part. Let me show you what to do. Right here, there's a straight line and it hits the edge of the heart. Now you curve, it's not just one curve though, it's going to be two curves, okay? So we're gonna go one curve, and then another curve. And then a straight line. Same thing above it. Straight line, one curve, and then another curve. Now is a good time to pause the video to give yourself a chance to draw what I've been showing you. Good job. And then right here, it's a broken line, so we just imagine that this line continues to go behind the heart. Nice. So now we get to use any color we want to fill this in. This heart here can have a stripe full of little lines. See, this stripe is filled with little lines. And this is going to be filled with little dots. Nice, so far so good. Let's see, I am going to use black now and I'm going to put little stars and dots on my pink stripe. Why? Because I like stars. All right, and maybe, what else can I draw? Hmm, I'm going to draw a zigzag line right here. Cool. 
And this one will have a wavy line. Remember our practice, we used our pencils to draw wavy lines and zigzag lines, spirals and broken lines. Yeah, cool, I like it. So hopefully you had fun drawing your heart with me. I'll see you next time. Bye.